Hello everyone, this is Mamta Mund and today we are going to learn and solve exercise questions 1 to 6, exercise 2a of chapter 2, chapter name is Fractions of class 7th of Composite Mathematics textbook. If you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, then please subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit the bell icon for getting notifications of future videos. And please visit my blog matchgrade.com for more information regarding the textbook solutions of CBSC, ICSE and other state board. Let's get started and solve some questions. Today we will learn and solve exercise questions 2a, questions 1 to 6 of chapter 2, chapter name is fractions and topics are types of fractions, addition and subtraction of like fractions, addition and subtraction of unlike fractions and addition and subtraction of mixed fractions. Let's solve some questions. Now question number 2, first bit, simplify. 3 divided by 7 plus 1 divided by 21 minus 1 divided by 14. First find out the LCM. Here all these fractions are, uh, are unlike fractions because they have different denominators. 7, 21 and 14. They, are, they have different denominators. Denominators are unequal. First find out the LCM. LCM of 7, 21, 14. 7, prime factorization of 7 is 7, 21 is 7 multiplied with 3 and 14 is 7 multiplied with 2. So, LCM will be 7 multiplied with 3 multiplied with 2, 42. So, LCM is 42. Now, find out the addition of these unequal fraction that is equal to the denominator LCM is 42 you can take the LCM 42 now divide 42 to 7 ke saad divide karo ge to 7 6 ja 42 then multiply 3 with 6 3 multiplied with 6 is then 42 divide hoga 21 ke saad so 2 then 1 multiplied with 2 then minus 1 multiplied with uh, 42 divided by 14 is 3 then 1 numerator 1 multiplied with 3 which is 42 3 6 is 18 plus 2 minus 3 20 minus 3 is 17 17 divided by 42 which is the answer. So, addition of these fractions 3 divided by 7 plus 1 divided by 21 minus 1 divided by 14 is 17 divided by 42. This is one of the method and second method will be we, uh, you can convert this each fraction into equivalent fraction. Here pe 17 divided by 42 nikla. So, this ko likhte hain. Ek method mein aise nikla. Phir second method mein karke dikhte hain. Hoongya? The first method, method hua. Or second method may first convert each fraction into equivalent fraction. Second method. So, here pe 3 divided by 7 hai. Or LCM nikla hai 42. So, here pe uh, find the uh, number multiply with the denominator. Here pe 7 denominator hai. 7 ko multiply karo ge. Kis number ke saath to? Uska na. Uh, LCM 42 के साथ equal होगा तो 7 6 जा 42 now multiply the same number 6 with the numerator 3 3 6 जा 18 now 3 divided by 7 and 18 divided by 42 both are equivalent fraction अभी 1 divided by 21 को equivalent fraction में convert करो यहां पे 21 denominator uh, 21 को multiply करोगे 2 के साथ तो LCM 42 के साथ equal होगा तो 21 now multiply the numerator 1 with the same number 2. 1, 2 is 2. So 1 divided by 21 and 2 divided by 42 are equivalent fraction. Now 1 divided by 14. Convert this fraction into equivalent fraction. Multiply the denominator 14 with 3. We will get 42. Now multiply the same number 3. 
with the numerator 1. 1, 3 is a 3. Now 1 divided by 14 and 3 divided by 42 are equivalent fraction. 3 divided by 7 ka equivalent fraction nikla. 18 divided by 42 plus 1 divided by 21 ka equivalent fraction nikla. 2 divided by 42 and 1 divided by 14 ka equivalent fraction nikla. 3 divided by 42. Common denominator 42. Now add this numerator 18 plus 2 minus 3. 20 minus 3, 17 divided by 42. Now 17 divided by 42 is the answer. Both have. Here first method we have 17 divided by 42. Here we second method we have 17 divided by 42. Both are equal. So both the uh, first method and method may be called. जैसे फर्स्ट एलसीएम निकाल के उसको डायरेक्ट ही वहां पे डिवाइड करोगे डिनोमिनेटर के साथ फिर उसको मल्टीप्लाई करोगे न्यूमरेटर के साथ जो वैल्यू निकलेगा फिर यहां पे सेकंड मेथड में फर्स्ट एलसीएम निकाल दोगे फिर उसको कन्वर्ट करोगे ईच फ्रैक्शन को इक्विवेलेंट फ्रैक्शन में इक्विवेलेंट फ्रैक्शन में निकाल के फिर उसका इक्वल डिनोमिनेटर निकल जाएगा फिर इक्वल डिनोमिनेटर निकलने के बाद फिर उसको ऐड कर दोगे न्यूमरेटर को डिवाइडेड बाय कॉमन डिनोमिनेटर तो ऐसे भी कर सकते हो नहीं तो फर्स्ट मेथड में भी कर सकते हो जो इजी लगेगा वैसे कर सकते हो तो यहां पे आंसर हुआ 17 डिवाइडेड बाय 42 नाउ सेकंड बीट 1 डिवाइडेड बाय 2 minus 1 डिवाइडेड बाय 4 plus 5 डिवाइडेड बाय 8 यहां पे फर्स्ट एलसीएम निकालोगे 2 4 8 uh, बोथ हैव डिफरेंट डिनोमिनेटर्स ऑल दिस फ्रैक्शंस हैव डिफरेंट डिनोमिनेटर्स all these fractions are on, unequal, having different denominators. So, here we have LCM. Nikaloge. LCM of 2, 4, 8. Prime factorization of 2 is 2. Prime factorization of 4 is 2. Multiplier is 2. Prime factorization of 8 is 2. Multiplier is 2. Multiplier is 2. So, LCM nikla. 2 multiplier is 2. Multiplier is 2, which is 8. So, here यहाँ पे LCM first निकाल दो 2, 4, 8 का LCM हुआ 8 then 8 divide 8 with the denominator 2, 4 now multiply the numerator 1 with 4 then minus 1 multiply with multiply with this LCM 8 with denominator 4 8, 4, 8 divided by 4 is 2 now multiply 1 with 2 plus multiply, divide करोगे 8 को denominator 8 के साथ तो 8 divided by 8 is 1 multiply the numerator 5 with 1 now 4 minus 2 plus 5 divided by 8 4 plus 5 9 9 minus 2 7 7 divided by 8 so answer was 7 divided by 8 so 1 divided by 2 minus 1 divided by 4 plus 5 divided by 8 is 7 divided by 8. Its answer was 7 divided by 8. <coughs> Question number 3rd bit. 18, 2 divided by 3, minus 15, 5 divided by 6, plus 4, 1 divided by 8. Now first, whole number ko ek ki jaga add kar do. So 18 minus 15, plus 4 add all these whole numbers and these are the proper fraction 2 divided by 3 minus 5 divided by 6 plus 1 divided by 8 now 18 minus 15 plus 4 4 18 plus 4 is 22 22 minus 15 is 7 7 plus now find out the LCM 3 6 8 so prime factorization of 3 is 3 and prime factorization of 6 is 3 multiplied with 2 and prime factorization of 8 is 2 multiplied with 2 multiplied with 2 so maximum number of 2 is 3 times so LCM will be 2 multiplied with 2 multiplied with 3 which is 24 is the LCM this is LCM now divide the denominator 3 with the LCM that is 24 24 divided by 3 is 8 now multiply 
the numerator 2 with 8. Then minus multiply the numerator 5 with 24 divided by 6 is 4. Now divide 24 with 8, 3. Multiply the numerator 1 with 3. So 7 plus 12 just 16 minus 20 plus 3 divided by 24. Which is 7 plus 16 plus 3 is 19. 19 minus 20 is minus 1. Minus 1 divided by 24. Which is 7 minus 1 divided by 24. So 7 multiplied is 24 is 168. Minus 1 divided by 24. Which is 167 divided by 24. Mm. Hundred sixty seven, which is equal to one hundred sixty eight minus one divided by twenty four which is 167 divided by 24. So 24, 7 minus 168, 24, 6, 120 and 144, 144. You make a 167 divided by 24 is improper fraction. So convert this improper fraction into mixed fraction. 167 divided by 24. Which is 24, 6, 144. Now 2, 3. So 6, 23 divided by 24. This is the answer. This is the mixed fraction. So 18, 2 divided by 3 minus 15, 5 divided by 6 plus 4, 1 divided by 8 is 6, 23 divided by 24. So answer is 6, 23 divided by 24. Question number 4th bit. 22, 9 divided by 11 minus 8, 1 divided by 4 minus 2, 1 divided by 6. First, add all the whole numbers. That is 22 minus 8 minus 2 plus 9 divided by 11 minus 1 divided by 4 plus 1 divided by 6. 22 minus 10 is 12. 12 plus now find out the LCM 11, 4, 6. Prime fluctuation of 11 is 11. And prime fluctuation of 4 is 2 multiplied is 2. So maximum number of 2 is 2 times. And prime fluctuation of 6 is 2 multiplied with 3. So this is the LCM. 11, 2 is 22, 22, 2 is 44, 44, 3 is 3, 4 is 12. 132. So 132 is the answer. Now divide 132 with the denominator 11. We will get uh, 12. Now 132 divided by the denominator 4. 4, 3 is 12. And 4, 3 is 12. 33. Minus 1 multiplied with 132 divided by 6 is 6, 2 is 12. 6, 2 is 22. Now 12 plus 12, 9, 
is 108 minus 33 minus 22 divided by 132. Uh, 12 plus 108 minus 55. 108 minus 55 divided by 132. 12 plus 8 plus 53 divided by 132. Fifty three divided by one hundred thirty two. This is the answer. Twelve fifty three divided by one hundred thirty two. So twenty two nine divided by eleven minus eight one divided by four minus two one divided by six is. 1253 divided by 132. If you have not subscribed my YouTube channel, then please subscribe my YouTube channel. And if you have any doubt, then please write in comment section and I will reply. Keep learning, keep watching, and please subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you. If you like this video then please click the like button and share this. If you have not subscribed my youtube channel then please subscribe my youtube channel and hit the bell icon for getting notifications of future videos. If you have any doubts then please write in comment section and I will reply. Keep learning, keep watching and thanks for watching. Please subscribe my youtube channel. Thank you.